So in this video, I'm going to show you how to manage the Facebook comments you get on your Facebook ads by either banning someone completely from your page, by hiding the comment, or by deleting the comment that they leave on one of your ads. So to get started, here's one of my ads that I've got running uh, right now on Facebook. I've actually been running this ad for over a year now and it's still converting well, which by the way, if you want to learn the strategy that we use to create ads that last a very long time without you having to keep changing it all the time, then just check out salesappointmentsmasterclass.com to watch the training that I've recorded that goes through how it all works in more detail. But anyway, once you're running ads, you'll start to get comments from people and some of these comments will either be good. Uh, so we've got this comment here, as you can see, this is a good one. Uh, other comments will maybe be talking about something in your ads and they're not good and they're not bad, they're just sharing an opinion. Like for example, this person says, uh, you know, the first line in the ad says that there's no fancy videos. And then the last line says, click to watch the video. Uh, so for me, that's not a bad comment. That's just maybe a little bit more of a misunderstanding or maybe it's their opinion. Those comments I personally think are absolutely fine. And I would go ahead and leave them. Like this person also said the same thing uh, where I said that you can get results without posting on social media. So I said no social media postings. And then it, he said written in a sponsored Facebook post, which, which is kind of funny. I can see where he's coming from. But then I just clarified that a sponsored post is a Facebook ad, which is different to just a normal social media post. So anyway, these kind of comments, I think are not bad. They're not good. They're, you know, they're just normal comments and I will just go ahead and leave those. Now, what you will sometimes get is comments where people are maybe being uh, abusive or they're posting just spam on your feed or just something that has absolutely no relevance to what it is that you're doing. And then for those comments, those are the ones that I would recommend that you either hide them or that you either ban the person completely from the page depending on what they're posting. So if you think this is a type of person that is going to keep posting bad things on your Facebook ad and they're not sharing an opinion, they're, you know, they're just spamming you basically, then those people, I would probably just go ahead and ban them from seeing any of the posts or ads on your page. So how do you ban someone from your Facebook page or your Facebook ads? So what you need to do is put your mouse over their Facebook name and then you'll see a little screen pop up that looks like this. And then what you need to do is go to the three dots, click on that and then click, whoops, I just missed it there. Click on that and then click on block, okay? And I'm not going to do it obviously, um, but just to show you what would happen when you click on block, it will then tell you that this person will no longer be able to see any of your page posts or anything like that. If you click confirm, it will go ahead and block that person. Now, obviously this is just an example. I don't wanna block him, uh, but that's how you would do it if you did want to block someone from your Facebook page. So the other thing you can do is also hide a comment or delete a comment. So what's the difference between deleting a comment or hiding a comment? Well, when you delete a comment, it means that the person that wrote the comment can see that it's been deleted. And sometimes this can cause more problems. So in most cases, I wouldn't recommend that you do that. In most cases, what I would recommend is that you just hide the comment instead. So when you hide a comment, the person can still see their comment and they think it's a comment that's still there to everyone to see. But what actually happens is no one else apart from you and the person that wrote the comment can see that comment. So no one else can see it. So if you wanted to hide a comment, um, you would just go to the three dots here over the comment, click on that and click on hide comment. And again, only you and the person that wrote the comment would be able to see this. Now, again, I don't recommend hiding comments on comments like this, which are absolutely fine, even if they don't necessarily agree with what you say. You know, sometimes I don't think that's necessarily a bad thing. Or if you wanted to delete it altogether, again, you would click on it like this. So this is how you would manage your Facebook comments. And also just one more tip, you can also manage all of these actions that I just did from the Facebook pages mobile app. So if you download that app on your phone, you can do all of this from your phone without you having to log into your desktop or laptop computer to manage all the comments.